What's up guys? Welcome back to the J Rubal Fishing Channel. Um, on the last video we did the Guggen Mega Mystery Kit. Today we're going to do the Guggen um, Crate from Carl's. So let's uh, zoom in and get into this unboxing. Uh, this one I think is $80. It's like a returning, a reoccurring subscription. Like the Carl's Mystery Tackle Box, but I guess it's specifically to Guggen Baits. First off, we have our cool dibbles, but in the Guggen style, it lets you know what kind of, uh, how much each lure, each lure is. Looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen lures inside for 89 bucks. So that's not too bad. Got this pretty cool Catch Co sticker. Then we have this little book. Kind of shows you where to fish things, how to fish it usual uh, mystery tackle box stuff that's pretty cool uh, we have this useless paper and then now we're into the lure so let's see what we have we have a uh, Guggen Squatch Saucy Swimmer in a 3.3 inch this is their sexy shimmer is what it's called kind of like a sexy shad type color It's a pretty solid soft plastic. Looks to have like a um, kind of like a gray top with a chartreuse clear bottom, or like it's bottom with chartreuse fleck. It's pretty solid. This is something I would use for like a trailer, or even putting on like a small hook with the bullet weight, and then swimming for like smallmouth. Pretty solid swim bait. These ones aren't the most durable, but. That's pretty good action. Next up, we have another zinger. There's that Guggen Squad zinger in white. Um, this is their bigger version. This is the 3 8 ounce. Here's a look at that nice white. We could even pair this up with the saucy swimmer that we got and give it a uh, nice little swim bait trailer. Huh, I didn't notice this before, but if, let's see if you can see this. So there's p strands of like pink on the bottom of this. So it's like a white and pink color. It's pretty nice. I didn't notice that before. But here's that little saucy swimmer. And we're just gonna line it up like this. That's where we get where we want it. Just like so. Just like this. And we're gonna thread it on. Now it's on there. That's how you want your hook to be. And now your zinger has a nice little swim bait trailer. So that's pretty cool. Those are the first two items in the crate. Oh, that's a zinger case. Next up, we have some Guggen Squad um, Kraken Craws. This is the California Craw. I think it's, as you see, it's a nice little uh, green pumpkin with red fleck in it. Nice little watermelon, watermelon color. So it's a nice little soft plastic. I would use that in like a Texas rig or even as a trailer for a jig. Put these back in here. Up next we have, oh, this is pretty cool. This is their, uh, Swim bait. This is their contender. If you're a Carl's member, you get them for like 12, 13 bucks, so it's not too bad. But here's a look at that Guggen Squad contender. I think this is the mini. Let's see. 
oh yeah, this is the junior contender in a two-third ounce slow sink. So this is the smaller version and this is just a jointed swim bait, kind of like a buka or like a six cents trace. Has like a hard tail. So I don't think this will come off, but pretty solid little swim bait. All right. Up next we have a, oh, this is a cool Grass Hero jig. This is a 3 8 ounce Grass Hero and a Chartreuse in white. So here's a look at that chartreuse and white swim bait, or not swim bait, this is a swim jig. But this is pretty cool, nice chartreuse top, white bottom, nice little brush guard. This is a 3 8 ounce, you could even pair this up with one of these uh, saucy swimmers and it'd probably look totally, probably look pretty good. Actually this is just too bad, this is really not These ones are cool, they give you enough for an A-rig too. So this is how you're gonna rig up one of these swim jigs is you line it up right here. I push my brush guard down, or at least to the side, and I'll come through the top as flush as I can. And then right through the top like that. Push the head on like that. And there you go, you have a nice little swim jig. And this is that same trailer that they sent to, or they gave us when we first opened, the same Saucy Swimmer, so that's pretty cool. Enough for two trailers, and then if they come off, we have extra. Up next, we have a pack of hammer hooks. Four uh, I think these are the same size hammer hooks we got in the Mondo kit, so that's cool. Can't go wrong with four-aught hooks. This is a Guggen Squad Mini Recon. This is a three to six foot diving bait. It's a smaller version of their um, regular recon. I think they make a smaller version, which is the micro recon. But this is their mini, so it's kind of like the size of a uh, six cents MD uh, 25, where there's be about the same size and it'd be like the same mid depth diver. So this is a pretty solid little crankbait. Use this for like smallies. Um, even trout would hit this pretty good. This is pretty cool. This is a new lure I don't have. I don't have any of their mini crankbaits. Then we have another, that's kind of disappointing, but this is a Guggen Squad uh, Banger and the Chartreuse Black Back. Uh, we got this exact same lure in the Mondo kit. And I'm pretty sure this lure has been on sale at Carl's too. So this could be another one of those colors that they just had like a bunch of and just threw in these boxes to get rid of. But still a solid little square bill. Um, I'll be giving this one away. So go ahead and comment on the Mondo video in this video, which one of these lures is your favorite. And I'll probably give this away and a couple other things. So up next we have a clutch in another disappointing color. This is their Sriracha Craw. We got this exact same lure in the Mondo kit as well. So here's that Sriracha Craw. Go ahead and um, leave a comment on the Mega Mystery Kit video and then the Guggen Crate video. Uh, if you want a chance to win this and that Chartreuse Banger. So now we have a Guggen Recon. This is their uh, bigger version. This is a nice little uh, chartreuse blue back. These work pretty good in like uh, stained water. This is the deeper diving one. So this one goes, I think, eight to 12 feet. So that's pretty deep. 
but not a bad little color. What's good about this one is that uh, we did not get this in the Mega Mystery Kit. So this is not another duplicate, this is a new lure. So that's pretty cool. Then we got a pack of Lunker Logs. This is the sprayed lettuce. So it's green with the kind of like purple fleck in it. This is pretty cool. For uh, for using a lot of Guggen baits, I don't think I fish the Lunker Log a lot. I usually go towards like a clout or like one of those style baits. So here's a look at that uh, Guggen Squad um, Lunker Log. It's a solid little stick bait. I'd probably uh, Wacky Rig it, Texas Rig it. Even weightless, you could probably weightless and then pop it like a jerk bait, and it'd probably still produce. So that's a cool little plastic. Don't have any of these. Up next, we have. Would you believe it? Another duplicate from the Mega Mystery Kit. This is a Guggen Squad flat banger. I'm pretty sure it's the shotgun shad. Yep, shotgun shad. So this will be another lure that will probably be given away. Shotgun Shad, uh, flat banger. This is just their two to five foot diving, um, flat sided square bill, or flat sided crankbait. Pretty solid color, but this is the exact same color we got in the mystery kit. So it's another duplicate. So far this hasn't been too too good so it's like their duplicate all right let's see what else we have look another duplicate this is a Guggen squad um, junior scout in the sexy shad this kind of sucks this is another lure we got in the mega mystery kit a little junior uh, scout And that was the last lure in the box. So we got the Junior Scout duplicate from the Mega Mystery Kit, the Flat Banger Mystery Kit uh, duplicate, the Chartreuse and Blackback Square Bill, which is another duplicate, and then we have the Sriracha Craw, which is another duplicate. So out of all those, we got four duplicates of the same exact baits from the Mega Mystery Kit. But other than that, we got this pretty cool um, Junior Contender, which is a brand new lure for me. This is probably my favorite lure out of the box. Then we have this Mini Recon, which is pretty cool. This is another new lure for me. Then we have the Chartreuse and Blue Recon. I think I only have another recon, but it's not in this color. So this is another new lure, not too bad. Then we have our two soft plastics, the Lunker Logs and the Kraken Craw. I have a couple of these, but not in this color. But this is brand new, I don't really use these ones a lot. So I'm excited to try those. And then we have the Guggen Squad uh, Grass Hero Jig. This is pretty cool. I'm excited for this one. I don't really have anything white and chartreuse in a swim jig. Usually just in um, spinnerbait. So pretty excited for that one. Then we have these cool saucy swimmers in a pretty cool color. Uh, sexy shimmer. Then we have our cool zinger that we got in a 3 8 ounce. This is pretty cool. It has like a white and pink color if you can see it on the camera sometimes when I twist it like that and this is just a solid spinnerbait um, I like spinnerbait so I'm pretty happy with that I think I have that color but it's pretty beat up so I was due for a new one and then a pack of four-aught hooks 
I think this is another duplicate. So that makes five duplicates from the Mega Mystery Tackle Box or the Mega Mystery Guggen Kit and the Guggen Crate. So if you bought the Mega Mystery Kit, expect to get the exact same duplicates in your Guggen Crate. But the Guggen Crate did come with some pretty cool stuff. That's it guys, thanks for watching, you know, the unboxing. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Um, comment your favorite lure on both the Mega Mystery Kit and the Guggen Crate video. And I'll be giving away some of these duplicate lures to you guys. Um, thanks for watching, make sure to share and hit that like and subscribe button.